Hey everybody, it's LBDL here and thank you for coming on over to my spot. Yes. So today I wanted to show you guys some fall lipsticks. Now these are some really cute lipsticks. Just a variety of colors that look beautiful in the fall. So I know some people are thinking, mm, I don't want no dark lipsticks or mm, I don't want them to all be matte. But um, trust me, there are going to be some beautiful colors just like the one I'm wearing right now. It's gorgeous, right? It's a purple, um, a bit of a sheer color. So we'll start right here. Before we continue, I want you guys to subscribe. Um, again, this is LBDL. So go ahead and subscribe, y'all. Let your mama know, let your auntie know so she can subscribe. All right, let's get started. <laughs> So the first color I want to show you guys is this beautiful color that I have on my lips right now. It's a uh, Maybelline Vivid Hot Lacquer. Okay, isn't this beautiful? And it's in the color 78 Royal. You might want to get a color like this because it makes you look royal and regal. So anyway, um, it's a beautiful color. It's shiny. It's glossy as you can see. Um, and it goes on smoothly. So as you can see, the shade that's on my lips is a little different than what the uh, color looks like in the bottle. But um, you know, it's okay, it still looks good. So this is a bit sheer, not, not really sheer, but you know, you might wanna put on a couple different layers just to make sure you get the, um, the level of purple that you're looking for. So it's a beautiful color, right? So gorgeous for fall. Uh, we have on those beautiful rich colors or maybe we have on the black or maybe a red. This just looks good, okay? So. <laughs> All right, on to the next. Okay, so this next shade is a bit of a nude color. So this would look really good on us uh, women of color, us black women, because it is a nude, but um, not too light it, it looks really good so I'm going ahead and put this on so all the lipsticks that I put on today I'm not going to put any liner on them so this is just as they come out of the uh, tube So isn't that gorgeous? It's really a nude color. So uh, if you're not into nudes, hey, not all of us are, um, you may not like this color, but I don't know how well it shows up on camera, but it is a really pretty color. It's very, you know, it's very nude. So if maybe you're not a lipstick lover, or maybe you don't wear lipstick very often and you want a subtle shade to ease into wearing lipsticks, this would be a great shade. So this is L'Oreal and this is the shade 804. He thinks he's macho, like macho or macho. He thinks he's macho, okay? So um, like I said, this would be a cute color. Maybe you're not into wearing lipstick or maybe you are a younger person and maybe you're like, oh, I've always worn lip gloss. This would be a really good color to ease your way into wearing lipstick because people would hardly even notice you have it on, but just a little bit of a hint of a color. On to the next one, y'all. All right, guys, so this beautiful shade that I have on my lips right now, it is a black radiance color. Mm, isn't it beautiful? And it is in the color Queen B, baby. Queen B, baby. It's 5508, and the name is Queen B. Gorgeous, right? Mm. Okay, so this is what the tube looks like. So this is a very rich color, um, a maroonish, reddish color, maroon, reddish, burgundy-ish family color. Great for ball. I see how y'all looking at me. I see how y'all looking at me with this color on. It's really cute too, but I know it's not for everybody. It is uh, Black Radiance's 
Brilliant Effects lip gloss in the color Black Diamond. So it's a, a sheer black lip gloss. I know it's not for everyone. <laughs> but this is also um, a shade that you might want to wear for like Halloween where you want to dress up and you want to look cute, you know, but you don't want to wear any other color. But this would be a really cute color. It's a, it's a black um, and it's got glitter in it. It's really shiny, really, really shiny. The thing with this is you would have to put on several different layers, you know, a couple different layers to get um, a darker shade of black or or you could put on a black lipstick or some type of um, black liner on your lips and that will help to make it even darker if you want it. So I know y'all ain't gonna all like this, but I think it's cute. What do you think? Let me know in the comment box, would you wear this color? I think it's kind of cute, right? So these last few colors that I'm going to show you, I'm showing them last because uh, they are matte and it's a little bit more difficult to get them off. Okay, so this is the one I've been rocking lately. I've been wearing this one to work. It's really cute, right? Now I know it looks really similar to the Black Radiance uh, Queen Bee color, but I think this is a little bit of a smoother application, quite honestly. So this is the Rimmel London Stay Matte Liquid Lip Color. And it is in the color Trust You, okay? I think it's really cute. Tell me what you think, tell me what you think, tell me what you think. <laughs> All right, so the next color coming up. What? What? Now, this color, I, I will say, I will say, this is my favorite shade. This is my favorite, hands down. This is a gorgeous color. I love it, please believe me. So, this is Milani's Obsession. I'm on this color for real. And it's their Amour Matte Lip Cream. Mm. And even now, I just put it on and it's it's matte. It's matte, it's matte. So this, if, if it's not showing well on camera, this is like a a darker pink fuchsia turned up a notch with like a little purple. Gorgeous color. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about this color. Do any of you have this color? And um, the way this goes on so smoothly and I just, you know, love the way it feels on my lips. I'm thinking about getting um, some more of the Milani Amore Matte lip cream so let me know if there are any other colors that you guys would suggest ah because i love this mm, I just love it <laughs> all right one last color one more hold on y'all just hold on just a little bit um one more color and i'll be back okay now y'all know y'all know we couldn't have a fall lip color um best of video without this is a beautiful deep red. Now, I'm choosing to do this color as one of the last colors in the bunch, not because I like it the least, but because it is one of the most difficult colors to get off of your lips, okay? One of the most difficult colors to get off of your lips. So, this is the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick. And it is in the color Matador 368. Now this is a beautiful color. It's a beautiful color, but when you decide to put this on, you wanna make sure that you want this color on. Cause it's not a color that you can just take off really easily and you know, you're done with it. No, it's gonna take a little work and it might mess up the rest of your makeup. So you wanna make sure before you put any of these infallible colors on, um, you wanna make sure that you are really really sure that this is what you want so <laughs> it's not quite a tattoo but it feels like one trying to get it off no but again it is a really really beautiful color so again this is l'oreal's infallible and it is in the color matador so let me show you how difficult it is uh to budge after you've gotten this lipstick on okay 
barely any on here, right? And I just put this lipstick on, so I'm surprised that this much even came off on the lipstick. Or <laughs> I'm surprised that even this much even came off on the on the uh, tissue because normally it's not a lot. So again, very little. But the thing is, when you put this lipstick on and you want to take it off, you want to use some oil-based um, remover, okay? Because otherwise, it is not budging, okay? I'm just saying, though. All right, y'all. Well, I want to thank you guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching the video. Again, don't forget to subscribe. Let me know in the comment box. Um, what lipsticks you guys like or what are some of your fall favorites because I would love to try some others. Thanks for watching. So it'll be out. Bye.